try and get ourselves a weapon here. Oh, is that one to see there? Nope, just a pile of sticks, fantastic. Hopefully we'll be able to get another weapon somewhere in this area. Oh, a backpack and a helmet, that will come in useful. Um, can't see a weapon yet. Level 2 vest, that'll do me nicely. Oh, someone's got a gun, fantastic. That's what we also get one shotly. Seems to be a lot of piles of sticks everywhere that look like guns, but aren't guns, which is helpful. Um, this is not looking good for us. I think maybe we should just kind of bug out of here. This is kind of like um, a murder film here. Because we get hunted down without a means to defend ourselves. I'm just trying to find some stairs down. Level 2 backpack, snag that. Nothing here. No, let's just, I think let's just make a run for it. See if we uh, we can find anything in the um, the uh, workyard here. I'm often quite lucky with these crates, but seemingly not today. Um, see, I'm kind of worried this guy's going to finish up looting in that building and then um, move out into the courtyard here and dispense of us, so... Kind of tempted just to kind of bug out of this area and head to some of the buildings nearby. Um, so I think that's what I'm going to do here. So long, guy. See if there's anything in here. Oh, and there we have it. Found ourselves a... M16, which is an upgrade from nothing, um, sure is. So, even got a nice little quick attachment there for it. I still to this day, not sure what it does, but it's got to be an upgrade, surely. Um, it doesn't look like anybody's been here, and if you have, they've uh, missed a lot of loot, including an M16, which uh, which would surprise me, unless somebody's going for a sickle-only victory. If so, good luck to them. Something I've tried, actually. Um, did about two rounds of it, and then I've uh, I've deemed it unwinnable. Um, the the melee system in this game is uh, not the greatest, so I'm just gonna continue looting through these buildings here, and uh, might set up shop in that little two-story building there, and see if our friend from the construction site decides to pay us a visit. If so, we'll uh, we'll try and get the drop on him. Oop, I think I can hear a vehicle heading to our location by the sounds of things. Yep, yeah, that's definitely heading here. Try and get some cover behind this little hill. I think he's going to drive on past. Oh, no, he's stopping. Got him. Hopefully this guy's going to have some good loot on him. Maybe it was the guy from over there. Who knows, but he's dead now. And, uh, Wow. This guy has level 3 vest, level 3 helmet, and a level 3 backpack. So we've kind of just about hit the jackpot here. I think I'm going to swap out the M16 for the Scar L. Seems to be the better of the two, to be honest. Don't know if I'm right or wrong there, but I think it comes down to personal preference as well. Um, obviously in a very exposed area here, so we want to kind of do this quickly. So I'm also not missing a thing. Nope. I think... Oh, God. So there's another person. Tell you what we're going to try and do here. I don't know how he didn't see me, but... We'll try and um, stalk him here. Given that my shooting is much to be desired, I'm going to try and go for a very unfair engagement here. Obviously favouring myself. Just prone here, see if we can wait for him to come out of these buildings. Oh, so he's gone into the two-story building which I was once at. If we can just put a prawn on this hill and wait for him to come out those doors, then um, give him a piece of our mind. Oh, try and get a headshot. Stay still. Okay, he's gone again. Okay, but now we can hopefully get him in the the open fields where 
isn't as much cover. I do love this part of the map. Reminds me of Fallout. Okay, so you... Oh! Another player has entered the, the game here. So we're going to head back inside. Hopefully we can um, let these two juke it out. And then, um, like a scavenger, will come in and uh, finish off the weaker one. So I can't see... Oh! So it turns out the guy who's shooting at the other guy can see... <coughs> excuse me. Where I am. Oh, and he's just killed him. So hopefully, fingers crossed, that guy doesn't know I'm here. And now I'll go and loot that body, and then we can kill him. Nice, easy. Oh, okay, so he's walking past me now. He's he's stopped. I don't know if he's just heard me walking around in here, but... Hopefully he's just outside looting that body. Switch to full auto here. Use this plane as cover. So he can't hear us coming for him. Well, that went much better than expected, and this guy has actually some amazing loot. A silencer there, if I was Scarrell, which is extremely rare. Extended mags as well. Um, seems like we've managed to get ourselves into a very good position so far this game, and uh, not done altogether that much looting. Just got a few lucky fights under our belt. Um, now we're looking very in a very good position to, uh, to win this game. So we're right in the middle of the zone, so I'm just going to kind of wait this one out. For a while, and see what the uh, the lay of the land, lay of the land sorry, uh, looks like when um, the zone moves in. Hopefully, it should whittle down the player number a bit as well. So, uh, fortunately, I didn't get too lucky with uh, how the zone ended up in the end. But uh, luckily, our our friend from the construction site delivered um, a vehicle right next to where we were. So I've jumped inside this now and uh, we're going to try and head further into the zone. Oh, a red package there. Kind of tempting to grab that, but it, it's very exposed. And B, we've kind of got really good loot as it is. So I think if we wait, we'll risk reward in that situation. Um, doesn't favour us too well. Um, so I'm going to head up into the coast here, which is a place I really like to go, actually. Um, on account, you only have to look 180 degrees for enemies as opposed to um, 365 degrees, which you usually have to. So there's a nice little defilade here we can kind of hide our vehicle in and uh, hopefully have a nice bit of peace and quiet. Well, maybe not. Here comes a car. Not sure if that guy was just following us for the whole trip, but either that or he got very unlucky. Nope, Jeep. I think they're going to head straight on past us here as the zone's moving in. Might be able to tag this guy as he jumps off his vehicle and uh, tries to run, run into the zone. I can't imagine he's going to expect to be expect anyone to be on his six here as he is driven into it. Can't see his vehicle anywhere. So exposed on this hill. Nice bit of cover there though. Oh, I can see. Can't still can't see him. Maybe that's his bike. Listening out for him as well. See if he's walking around nearby. I think I can see his. Oh, I think that must be his uh, June buggy there. No sign of him though. I wonder where he's gone. Would have expected him just to be hidden on one of those behind one of those trees, but seemingly not. I can kind of see the full zone here, and I'm very surprised there's still twelve people alive. And I can't, I can see nobody, and nobody's engaged with me either. Left it till the last second, but unfortunately the time is upon us. I am now running through ridiculously open terrain, trying to get to the new zone. Seems to be the story of my life on this game. Um, don't really like my of success. I can hear gunfire all around me. 
it would be nice to have a second to check in this crit, but that would mean probably dying by the blue zone. Um, and uh, to be honest with you, I'd, I'd take not checking in um, survival, to be honest. Oh, there's our friend on the dew buggy again. Maybe he's going to get out here and kill us. Nope. Okay, he hasn't seen us. That's good. Maybe we can kill him then. I was tempted to take a shot at him just then, but... Yeah, I don't think it would kill him. Um, and then he'd know where we are. Well, that was lucky. Trying to listen for anyone else. The zone is ridiculously small now. Actually, only six people left. It's one of them awkward end zones where it's just kind of perched on top of a hill. And um, sight lines are pretty small. A lot of cover for people to hide here as well. Obviously, this first person mode means you can just lie down in the grass and it's very hard to be seen. Gunfire over there. Some guy's only actually got a vector or something. Sounded like a pretty small caliber bullet. Tend to dilute this guy, but that would mean kind of giving up our spot here. I think we're just going to circle around the kind of perimeter here. Try and spot anyone hiding. Oh. No, that's just a bit of a log. Always check for movement before you open fire. Oh, there's another person. He's just going to lie down there and let me kill him, apparently. Made hard work a bit, but we got there in the end. I kind of feel like when you stick the silencer on this gun, you lose a bit of its potency. Oh, a nice little red crate there. I'm tempted to have a look in there. Definitely heal up first, though. Actually, I don't even think we're in the zone. No, nope, we're not. Fantastic. Bush, be my protector while I heal up, please. Okay, somebody else has just died there with a Grozna. Fantastic. Somebody's got one of the best weapons in the game. Um, sounds pretty awesome though. Let's see me spiny movement. Oh, got him just before he managed to get to that tree. Now only one versus two. I'm sure that guy came to our south there, but I could be wrong. Try and see him moving into the zone. That's the direction I would expect him to come from. I don't see him anywhere. Ah, fuck. No. Ah, oh, man. God damn it. Number two. Ah, pretty, pretty, pretty mad with myself that I didn't come, uh, didn't know where that guy was, but I was, I was sure he was over there. Uh, but apparently not. Oh, well, uh, number two. Nothing to be scoffed at. Hopefully get number one uh, next time.